Hello and welcome to another episode of Crazy About Fly Fishing. Today I am back on the salt water and I'm doing a post intro because otherwise I don't know where to tell you what's going to happen. So today I was launched from Takapuna, I hit the markers, didn't get anything on the markers, drifted for some snapper, got a bunch of reasonable snapper panties, then went and had a look for some kawai, really didn't have much success, uh, followed a bunch of fast moving schools but really nothing happened. And then I moved over to another spot where I drifted again for snapper and I got a nice uh, 38 centimeter one and oh, a few yeah. more. So, yep, it was nice. a snapper day today. So, enjoy watching. Here you go. Oh, yep. There you go. A bit of snapper. Yep. Just letting a little bit of line out. I didn't think I was quite at the bottom. That will be. Hopefully, I can get it to the boat and it will be fish number one for the day. It feels small. The fish getting on board will be nice. Definitely not big. There it is, tiny little snapper <laughs> uh, at the uh, anchovy fly. Oh, it's on the board. Okay, sorting out the drogues and hook the fish. Recording, yes. Sorting out the sea anchors and, and hook the fish. Well, let's see what it is. I suspect it's a snapper. It's fighting like a small snapper. Yep. Snapper. Bigger than the last one though, it's not too bad. Almost a almost a legal size one I think. Nearly. Oh think there we go. Got it. So that that little snapper went 32 centimeters. So well that would have been an eating one, but not doing that today. There you go. Back home. Okay, well, at least on the board. Oh, yep, another fish. That's a better one. That's a better snapper. Nice. Nice. Coming up fast. Very fast, it's coming up. Had a good pull and then nothing. What happened here? It does look like a good fish. A reasonable fish. Yeah, that's a reasonable fish. No, it's not as big as I thought. It had a good initial take. <laughs> um, I thought we were really onto a much bigger fish, but I was wrong. It's about the same size as the last one. It's even smaller than the last one. I thought it was closer to the same size, but no, it's more like the first one. This is exactly when a big fish will grab it. This is what Murphy has in mind. Yep, there we go. Fish. F big take, didn't hook it because I'm tangled. And if I have another take now, I'm in deep trouble. I can't bring up the line because I'm severely tangled. No, 
sustained surface activity yet. Yep, yep, got a fish. It feels like a good one. Uh, let's hope. The last one felt good and it wasn't so good. This one's got a bit more. A bit more bang to it. Well, it feels like it. Then it, I thought that was the other one as well. And then it. Oh, that's more like a, It feels good initially and then it turns out to be small. There's a few, there's a, it's doing a few runs. Oh, it's a bit bigger than that. Oh, it's nicer. This is a nicer fish. That's a nicer fish. Okay, and that, that was 32 centimeters in the end. So yeah, nice. They're going a bit quiet. Oh, I said that. We get a solar tug. Fish feels a bit more decent, I hope. I really hope so. Feels like it's got a bit more weight to it. It's not doing massive runs, but it'd be nice if we can get closer to the 40 centimeter mark. It's probably 35 or 38 maybe. Yeah, it's a better fish than the previous ones, but maybe 35. Wasn't too far off. 34 centimeters. Nice little snapper. Well, changing back to the uh, anchovy fly did the trick. I guess when there's that much anchovy bait around, that's what the fish want to eat. So the key to this deep drifting is having a really fast sinking line. Um, picking a depth that you can get to and just casting out 45 degrees letting it sink letting it hang over the bottom for a while and then bringing it up and it's generally on that hang over the bottom um, when you pick up the snapper So at the moment I'm using a 10 weight rod that's just because that casts this line um, to get deep down. So it's a 10 weight predator from I Love Fly Fishing. Um, it's my go-to 10 weight rod. So, and this shooting head is a DIY line that was made for me uh, by a fishing forum, fellow fishing forum member. And yeah, so far it's been working well. It, it can really help me get down quite deep. There's another fish. Same thing. The snapper really like it when it's just dead drifted. Feels a bit better. Oh, this one's got a... Uh, it's either spunky or very interested. I don't know why it's... It doesn't feel that big, but it has got a bit of a run to it. Now it's coming up at the right. Initial runs look promising, but not so much. It'd be nice if we can get a bit of fish. They're all around the 30 uh, something centimeter mark. But the nice thing is every, pretty much every cast is now resulting, if you get it right, is resulting in a fish. So if we can continue that, hopefully we'll pick up a bigger one. This is a small one. so. Oh, this is a small one, not very big. Well, I did a bit of driving around after no success with the speedy car wide schools. Uh, I've come to a spot that I've 
fished in the past so I've had good luck or good success just drifting so see what happens oh yep nice nice solid hit I think it's just because it's shallow I don't think it's a big fish so it's just pulling reasonably ha ah. ah how maybe I underestimated it A little knuckle in there. Hmm, might be a bit of fish than I thought. Looks like there's a bit of weight. It's shallower here, so you just see that it's enjoying the shallow water. Pretty nice if it's a good fish. Putting it on a good show. Not seen it yet. Could be the fish of the day so far. Oh, this looks like a nice snapper. Nice, closer to the 40 centimeter mark model. Nice, ha ha, that's a better fish, much better fish. Well, that's a better fish, <laughs> 38 centimeters. Nice snapper, happy about that. Let it go. The little tuck, yep, there we go. So I said more aggressive normally. Feels like a solid fish. Uh, maybe not so big. No, so big. It's trying though. This is not very big. It's giving a good tug. It does not pulling really pulling line. <laughs> there we go. Another little snapper. And that's the fly that's been doing the trick. It's that, uh, same as that Spam and Eggs, it's a variation of that Spam and Eggs fly, just a smaller one. Okay. Oh, yep. <laughs> Got him. With the, on the strip up. Little one though. <laughs> well, it's still three from three. Cast. So. It's a tiny one though. There we go, a little, little. Well, I was so focused on doing a post-tro intro that I never did an outro. So here's the outro. <laughs> I'm home now doing a bit of editing for Friday Fly Day. And yeah, it was a nice day of fishing. I really enjoyed catching a bunch of snapper. Probably not the most exciting fishing. It's a shame there was no surface workups or car wire and stuff like that and couldn't get any interest from a, from a kingfish. But that's how it goes sometimes. If you enjoy these videos and you like watching my uh, fishing videos and also the Friday Friday series, please take the time to subscribe if you haven't already and press the notification bell so you can see all the new videos when they come out. I'm posting weekly, well actually twice weekly with the Friday Friday. So yeah, there's plenty of content and uh, see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.